Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another apartment renovation, which I'm pretty sure you know that I, <laughs> I love doing the most. Um, I, I feel like I very rarely do like actual builds and opt to do like the apartment stuff more just because it's so easy and probably because I'm not very good with like exterior stuff. Um, I definitely should practice a bit more and get used to it. Um, but you know, I actually have not been on The Sims for a long, long time. And so it was kind of nice just going back to it to decorate because decorating actually really calms me down and makes me happy. And so here we are with an apartment one. But anyway, I want to say this one, and I feel like I say this about all of my stuff. This is probably my new favorite um, like design that I've done in a long time, just because it's very like me I feel like like the colors the just it just felt very me I guess <laughs> I don't know how else to explain it other than that but um I feel like a lot of my builds tend to be pretty similar but this one I did um something a little different I mean clearly I still used a brick which I love but I don't usually do like a lot of very um What's the word I'm looking for? It's not colorful, but I don't usually use like other colors aside from like more neutral ones, I feel like. I don't know. I should probably look back on like my old builds and actually and actually check if that's correct. But I just felt like a kind of darker, moodier apartment um, when I did this and um, green just kind of like clicked with me. Um, fun fact, green is actually my favorite color, <laughs> so this is why, again, um, this build seems like very me. Um, usually with apartment builds, I tend to build them or, you know, do them a little bit faster, but since this was kind of like, again, similar, I think, to my last upload, it was my first time going back into The Sims um, for a while, it did take a little longer. Um, I also did try to go into debug menu and it didn't quite work out that well for me, but you'll see that a little later. Um, anyway, so with this apartment, um, originally, if you saw like earlier, I tried to block off the bedroom, but I felt like because the apartment was already so small, it would just like close it up even more. And so instead of acting of having like an actual bedroom I decided to make it more like a studio which I really like so I'm glad I decided to do that something a little different I guess you can say um I really like the look of this chair like in in this build in general and so I did try to put it in um kind of like in the sitting tv whatever area but ultimately I decided to do um what's it called that love seat and that like kind of cozier um, armchair just because if I were to watch TV and you know for <laughs> a, a lengthy amount of time I would prefer it was it was more comfy like that like you know with arms to lean on and everything um, so yeah I actually did this build in the course of like three days usually a lot of my builds I'll do I feel like in in one sitting so usually takes like a couple hours but with this one um it was just like a little break from all the other games that I play I finagle with this bathroom a lot like I just could not figure out what I wanted to do with this bathroom and I think it was like the space just the nine tiles seemed a little too small so I did extend it like right here um, just because I really wanted the look of this kind of like, kind of like sliding door, um, shower. So I'm really glad that, um, with the university stuff pack, we got that, um, that shower, that shower head thing. And then I tried to make the, the shower a little bigger like this, but then I realized like the other stuff that I wanted to put in there wouldn't quite fit. 
Um, so I went back to that instead. I really did want to fit a tub in here and that's why I extended it. And um, I want to say I didn't clutter this build too much, um, probably because I got a little lazy towards the end. But sometimes not a lot of clutter, bleh, bleh, not a lot of clutter is good. Sometimes I like the look of clutter. I don't know. I think it's just my mood. Sometimes I'm, I'm really into the cl clutter. Sometimes I'm not. Most of the time it's just because I'm lazy. Um, I really wanted to use this. It's just so cute that I wanted to put it in there somehow. But just the swatches didn't quite match and so I was like, I'll use it like somewhere else another time. Um, I'm pretty sure you've noticed, I think in a lot of my recent builds, I've been using that um, tile. I forgot what they call it, but it's my absolute favorite for like the bathroom or sometimes I'll use it in the kitchen too. But lately it's been my favorite um, for the bathroom. Um, let's see, what else is there in this build? Um, very monochrome I guess you can say like I use a lot of dark like a lot of black a lot of gray and obviously it's just the green is like the accent um, here in the front I'm not sure if it's right now or a little later I do struggle a little bit because I was like oh I need to make space for um, the washer and dryer and so I finagle with that a little bit too um, my favorite, <laughs> my favorite um, standing lights, as usual, has made an appearance again. And plants, always gotta have my plants. Um, I really wanna have plants, like more plants inside the house, but me and my husband kind of have conflicting, like, um, tastes, I guess, or like style, or yeah, taste in, <laughs> in indoor plants. So we're trying to figure that out. Um, I just, I told him I want more plants inside the house and thankfully he's sort of kind of agreed for now. So we'll see. Maybe when, um, shelter in place is over and done with, um, you know, we'll actually like go to the store or go outside for other than just necessities. Um, but I did move around the kitchen a little bit as you saw earlier. Um, I think just with the shelving it made more sense to kind of switch it around the way I did. Um, for this one I was trying to find this, um, I, I'm trying to remember like a tray I guess from Tiny Living with like the with like a succulent and everything too and I couldn't find it for some reason and I went in there um, pretty recently and I found it and <laughs> I was so mad. I'm like where was this when I was doing this build? Um, but yeah, I, I love the Tiny Living Stuff Pack. I don't know if you guys have it. If you don't, please get it. It's just, I love it so much. And I think it just speaks to me and like, you know, a style <laughs> level. Like it just speaks to what I like. Um, but yeah, I wish we had more like succulents for like tabletop decor. Um, What was I saying? <laughs> um, I wish we had more succulents for tabletop decor because we do have a few others, but they're like in these cute, they're cute, but it doesn't like, it doesn't fit with a lot of like, you know, styles because they're like cat planters. So I'm like, I don't know if that, you know, it's just, I just wish we had more that weren't in cat planters, unless I'm just not looking again. Um, anyway, here is where, again, I finagle with <laughs> the walls and stuff because I was like, I need to fit that washer and dryer and originally I wanted to put it here, but I was like, no, I really want like a console table on there. Um, so I don't, I don't know why it was so difficult for me to be like, where should I put this thing? Um, so eventually I built that wall there kind of in the kitchen area and put that. Um, I did go into this game or into this build pretty recently to take screenshots and then I was like, oh no, I forgot to put the drain. I like to put the drain by the washer and dryer. Oh, I did! How come it wasn't there when I took screenshots? I'll have to look back into that. We'll see. Um, but there's the drain. I like having the drain there because um, I found that when my sim 
or any you know any sim that i have does laundry a lot of the time when they pull stuff out of the washer there's just like puddles everywhere so i've made it a habit to put a drain close by um another thing i noticed when i did screenshots was i completely forgot to put um curtains so i did that off camera um you'll see them in the screenshots they're not my favorite curtains like i wish we had um more like blinds I think I used blinds. I don't remember, did I use blinds? I might have used curtains, um, kind of like more in the living area and then kind of where the bedroom is, I use blinds in the kitchen. I have, we'll have to, <laughs> we'll have to check. Um, so what else is there? I really wanted to try putting like these shelves by the um, window, but I don't know, it didn't quite make sense to me like just the black against the white was kind of off for me so um i nixed it and decided maybe i'll do that for another build um and then instead of having like an actual dresser well there is a dresser but like a bigger one i really wanted the kind of rack thing i don't know it's just cute and i love that dresser by the way that was by that half wall and i really wanted to keep it on but it, it was just clashing with everything else I feel like which realistically it wasn't so bad I feel like but it just it just wasn't working for me um, so instead I put like um, painting I forget what else I put on there if I do put anything else and then this um, I kind of wanted to put a vanity but I opted for kind of like <laughs> this instead big mirror the little stool with um, the makeup and everything and I feel like the sim would probably just sit on the floor and like do her makeup while she's sitting on the floor I don't know sometimes uh, sometimes my train of thought does not quite make sense I feel <laughs> I don't know I just thought it was cute instead of having like a big um, you know vanity and because I didn't use like the big well not big dresser but more of like you know the wider dressers instead of having that I figured this is fine this sort of makes sense to me at this point in time not so much right now that I'm watching back my video um, but yeah I, I just thought it was cute so I did it um, I, I feel like do I clutter the kitchen a lot I think I did I remember I did go into debug to get like um, glasses, some mugs, um, and all of that. Um, there were some stuff that I saw that I pulled out and then it wasn't until I put like a sim in here that I was like, oh my God, I can't take this thing out. Like, why can't I delete it? And apparently I had to put it in a room, in a room, air quotes, and delete, and, um, delete it. And that's how it worked. So towards the end of this build, you'll kind of see it on the floor. Um, and I couldn't figure out how to, you know, how to get rid of it. And I was so mad. I was like, I should just bulldoze this entire, <laughs> this entire apartment because I'm so mad. But here it is. I did go into debug. Um, I don't know if these ones spoil. I'll have to check. So those, you see those things on the floor. I really wanted to use them for decor. Um, but because again, I did this in the span of like three days. When I came back, I couldn't click on them anymore. And I was like, I was, I was pissed. Um, but I figured out it's gone. I swear it's gone. Um, by the time this video is up, this, uh, apartment should be on the gallery as well. I still don't know what I'm going to name this, but you probably know because it's on the title. I don't yet. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, I probably should have picked better timing to go through debug, you know? Um, but I also just did the show hidden objects I think is what I did what I should have done also was do the live edit objects because I because I think there's like more stuff if I do that too but yeah see look how long I'm spending time in debug trying to find stuff that I just can't find it was really getting on my nerves and I think that's why it took me so long to um or why this build took me like three separate days instead of one sitting um Let's see. I think eventually I decided, you know what? I don't want to make this little coffee table thing too fancy. <laughs> so 
I just left the candle. I was just like, I'm done. I can't find the tray that I want. I can't find like cute stuff on debug that I want to put on here. Um, so yeah, uh, I really like what I did with the lights here in the kitchen. I really like the look of like um, these pendant, I guess, is that what you call them? Like pendant lights at different heights and different styles. Um, so yeah, <laughs> you see the cuts. You see the cuts of like when I ended my second session. I think the first one was earlier. Too lazy to cut it out, I'm sorry. But sometimes, sometimes it just works that way. <laughs> I don't know, I like coming back into The Sims again after a long time not being on The Sims, I guess, I don't know, like I'm not as, what's the word I'm looking for? It's not motivated or driven, but like I, I, I don't have the patience, I guess, as, as I used to. Or maybe I just got so frustrated with debug that I was like, I'm done. Who knows? But I, again, I am trying to get um, back into The Sims a bit more and trying to keep up with the uploads. Um, I want to know what you guys think about seeing other content on this channel aside from just The Sims. I know, like, originally, I don't know if you know this, but I did start this YouTube channel to kind of post um, my gaming videos. Unfortunately, I couldn't quite figure out um, how to record like the other games that I play. Like Final Fantasy works fine, but it's the very like graphics heavy games that tend to lag a bit on my OBS. I'm still finagling with that. I've used that word probably three or four times now. We should start a counter. Um, but I've, again, played around with my settings a lot, and I think I figured it out, but we'll see. Um, so let me know what you think about adding more, like, other game videos to this channel, or if you wanted to purely stay Sims. Again, I started this channel with the intent to put other, like, gameplay videos and not just The Sims, but it's kind of turned into just The Sims. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments below. I'd really love to know your thoughts. Um, I love playing video games so it would be great to kind of share my time with my other my time in other games with you guys um obviously I've had I've had a lot of the oh my god what is wrong with me I've had a lot of good you know times with friends in other games and unfortunately I wasn't like streaming or recording during those times um so we'll, <laughs> we'll have to figure that out um I'll also try to be more active on Twitch as much as possible, um, which is where I stream mostly. Um, I've been getting on there recently just to kind of look back into our videos when we do um, what we call progs or progress um, for raids in Final Fantasy. So that's mostly what I've been doing on there. But again, I'll try to be a little bit better and stream other stuff on there too, aside from just you know, Final Fantasy or whatever. I really like um, this area of the house. Like, I just love the look of, of open shelves and like all of those other things kind of on there. I feel like it brings a lot of character to a house. Um, so I'm hoping eventually that we can change our cupboards here at home in the kitchen. <laughs> I'd really want, like, we have this cupboard kind of by itself on the right side of our sink, and I'm hoping we can change that to open shelving. So we, you know, so I can probably display, like, my mug collection or whatever else. Again, just because I feel like it's, it brings a lot of character to display stuff. Um, especially, like, things that you collect or things that you like. Um, but yeah, we should be nearing the end of the video, I think. I think. Um, but yeah, again, let me know what you think about other gaming content on here. Um, and I hope to hear some feedback. That way I know what to do. Um, but yeah, here are the screenshots. I really, again, I really love... See? There! Look, the drain's gone. I wasn't imagining things. Well, I guess I'll have to put it back before I upload it onto the gallery. But... Um, 
thank you so much for listening to me ramble for the past almost 20 minutes. Um, as usual, I will see you in the next video and yeah, bye, take care.